many businesses and workers struggle during the pandemic, one man in Folsom decided to take a leap of faith. The 80-year-old has turned his love for art into a lucrative business in this grueling economic climate. CBS 13's Laura Hayfley is live with the man who says it's never too late to start something new. I love that, Laura. Yeah, that's right. A local gallery owner risking it all, starting something new here in Folsom with a passion for painting because why not just give it a shot? Palette knife and pasta painting, thick and textured. Got a lot of cows and pigs and a giraffe and an elephant. And I love the milk farm. My name is Tony and why not is Tony backwards? Nine weeks ago, in the middle of a pandemic, Tony Herps opened a brand new art studio. But why not paint now? It was only three years ago Tony picked up painting for the first time. I don't think this is something that can be taught. You either have it in you or you don't. And here's the milk farm. Fast forward, the local artist is 80 years old, and what was once a hobby has turned into all of this. All the flowers are oil. It's all splashed on. Yeah, that's my favorite painting. I love that painting. It was a lot of work. You must really love what you do. I do love what I do. I love to paint. He says it's like therapy in the middle of such uncertain times. If I wasn't painting, I don't know what I would be doing right now, especially during COVID. And painting has really um, helped me. This is a tough time to be starting something, and I'm really surprised that he is. Art lovers in Folsom are encouraged to see a new business doing so well. We've already lost so many businesses here in Folsom, and I don't want to see any more losses. And for him, it was a risk worth taking. I think you have to love to paint. And if you love to paint, it's that's the battle right there. We asked Tony if he's got any advice for people his age or anyone else looking to take on a new adventure. Do it. Go for it while you're still able to. Tony says the best thing about being an artist, he's been able to sell his paintings all over California, Utah, even as far as Paris. Nice. Talented guy, for we sure. We like his work, right? And not just because of his name. Absolutely. <laughs> why not? And the answer for me, why not, is because I can't paint worth a darn. So that's why, why not for me. Laura, thanks. Good story tonight.